Amy, you commanded attention when you walked into the room and you started out here. Everybody looks at you. And from an education perspective, this actually draws everybody's attention in. When you started your speech, everybody was like, oh, and your, your topic is something that I value completely, paper or plastic. They don't even give you an option anymore when you go up to the, the counter to check out. They don't ask you paper or plastic. They just assume plastic. I love your bags. Here's the problem with the bags. I forget them in the car. <laughs> How do I remember them from the car to inside the store? So I loved your introduction. I loved how you brought us all in. Here's a few things I'd like to give you to work on. You had your bag sitting right here. I was sitting here. Here's what I saw. Let me show you what I actually saw. <laughs> this is what I saw. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. It's okay, but actually, quite a few people actually do it. And I'm going to give you guys a definition of what I saw as well. Amy was talking to the group, so let's just say the group is here. And this is what the group, from my perspective, was seeing. So be careful in demanding attention. You can draw it in, but then take those steps back to make sure that your back is not to anybody. And to be right here is a good place to be because you're still commanding attention. You grabbed it when you started out here, but you command it when you stand up here, okay? Use a table to put your stuff on. And a lot of people do that, they put it on the floor. Put it up so that you're not bending over. Okay. So just so that it's right here, right, available to you. You could have also used right here. That would have kept you close to your notes when you pulled out your notes for just a split second. So that's just something to think about as well. You had some great topics that I love, save the planet. The other things that came to mind were reduce, reuse, recycle. I'm all about using the water bottle, that water bottle type as well. I have like six of them in my refrigerator. Um, drives the family crazy because they're always in there and they take up space in the refrigerator. But tap water, you know the best tasting tap water comes from the hose. <laughs> really, as children, how many of you drank out of the hose when you were outside playing? Oh wait, kids don't play outside anymore. <laughs> but that's the best tasting water. So that way, you know, just another piece to throw in there as well. I loved your topic. Loved it. The one thing I would have said to you at the end, tell us paper or plastic or neither or whatever the case happens to be. Okay. The great speech.